Welcome back to Celebrity Page. Earlier in the show, Arthur K. talked with the stars of Sorry to Bother You about their dark new film. Now we're going back to the New York premiere to find out what else the star-studded cast is up to in today's Hollywood Insider. From an anti-capitalist and sorry to bother you to Valkyrie and Thor, no one's having a bigger year than Tessa Thompson. When you look back over the last couple of years, what goes through your head about what's happened? Oh, it's it surpasses my my wildest dreams for sure. I never thought I would have a cape. She's also excited about her role in a major sci-fi reboot. Next, I get to have a neuralizer in Men in Black. See, I have watched those films in the last month. I cannot tell you umpteen times trying to figure out the magic of them. I think they hold up. I think they're fantastic films. So we feel a, a, a big responsibility, but it's going to be a fun one. Fresh off the success of The Walking Dead and his new movie roles, Steven Yeun is using his platform to inspire a new generation of Asian American actors. All I can be is proof that you can do it too. I hope they see me as just an example and not as some exact way to do things uh, because they have their own way to do it and they got to find that for themselves. Army Hammer finding his own way playing meaningful roles with projects like Sorry to Bother You and Call Me By Your Name. How do you break out of the I'm just a good looking guy mold? Uh, you make a bunch of studio films that flop and uh, you can't get another studio job and then you have to change your route. That's the formula. It worked for me. Terry Crews is also making a huge impact on the big and small screen with his own fairy tale success story. I'm one of these guys who has survived, but not only survived, living a dream life. And there was a quote that I really love and I kind of internalized, is that the height of your success is equal to the depth of your gratitude. And that's for real. And I, that means I'm really successful.